Hi guys, it's me Betsy, and I'm here to show you how to make trail mix, or yeah, basically trail mix. So I went to the store within the last month and got all kinds of different kinds of nuts, dried fruits, and a whole bunch of other kinds of nuts and dried fruits and stuff like that. So here we go. So I'm going to dump pretty much everything into this large bucket coat and go away at it. So I'm adding in pumpkin seeds and it's going to make a lot. Pineapples. Pecans, pecans, whatever, however you may want to pronounce them. Which I don't think everything of mine is going to fit in here. So I may have to do it in batches. Honey roasted peanuts. So I'm not doing the whole container. See where that takes me. Banana chips. Walnuts. Cashews. Kind of give this a mix. I'm gonna actually add in another bag of pineapples, fried pineapples, since they're not very, the bag's not very big. There's still one in there. Smoke flavored almonds. Shell pistachios. If you're going to make a lot like I'm doing, you're probably going to want a bigger bucket tote thing. Which I'm, I have another container that I can add into. Make some in. Or pour half of this into that. Which I may do. Which I will do now. Just to make it less in here. And I have a little scoopy thing.
it just actually has party mix in, but I am reusing it. I did wash it out. This is great for if you know anybody that goes to like the gym and works out, or it's also great to have. Um, like in your drawer at work so you can nibble on it throughout the day. Mm. Oops. Oh well. Apparently the floor was hungry. Now this bucket is pretty much Painter, if you want to call it that. We're probably going to fill all that up some more. Sunflower kernels. The bag does not want to completely open. Or half of those in. basically make your own leave out stuff add other stuff in okay well I can't add in the cranberries because I have to cut that open I'm gonna add in some crunchy Fuji apple fruit crisps Chickpeas. Probably just a bag of those for now. I'm going to add in some mango, dried mangoes. bigger than what I thought they were be. My goodness. Kind of probably, oh. You can rip them if you can, which I'm gonna, I'll just leave them like that. That's good enough. Add in some raisins. Possibly. I can. Oh, I 
hate it when they stick together. Good enough. Freeze-dried Asian pears. least, well, I had to add in the cranberries, I think it's scissors, um, pepitas, I think that's what they're, they're called, and they're roasted, Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill up basically three of these, three of these, but I'm only going to do one of these and then one of a different kind so that you can see how you can do this different ways. Because I'm actually giving these, the, these three of these containers to three of different friends of mine. I know two of them go to the gym and they work out regularly. So this will be good for them to keep like either in their car or in their gym bag after their workout. And the other one can probably keep it in his desk at work. That is a lot of mango. Shake this so it gets packed. I'm gonna stick more in here. Okay. There. 
what it looks like when it's done and they can just open this here and grab if they want or actually take this off and grab a handful but this is what it looks this one looks like and will be part of their Christmas present and then I have these little Ziploc goodie bag type things and you can which I got them from the there's 40 of them for a dollar at the dollar store which you can't beat for 40 of them and they do them like throughout the seasons and everything so they have like ones for Halloween ones for Christmas <laughs> 